Hello everybody. Today's screencast is an interactive quick quiz on eutectic phase diagrams and microstructures. It's a little bit different than the other screencasts that have been done in the past. So, what is it? It is an interactive quiz on the eutectic phase diagram. How does it work? You will click on a choice to answer a question that tests your knowledge of the phase diagram. What happens next? You'll be taken to a reward or try again scene, which are separate videos, that indicate if you made a right or wrong choice. If you made the right choice, what you do is you go back to the original pause video, so this video you're watching right now, and click on the next question button. If you made a wrong choice, what do you do next? You go back to this video, the original paused video, and select a different choice that you think is correct. And, after answering all the questions, you should have a better understanding of eutectic phase diagrams. So let's get started. Here's the first question. For the given conditions, 210 degrees Celsius and 8% tin at Roman numeral run, and this red dot right here, what is the phase composition and weight fraction? Your answer would go in this box right here, if we were doing it by hand, and your choices are 1, 2, three, four, and five. You will be given 20 seconds to answer the question, but if you need more time, feel free to pause the video. Here's question two. At the point 210 degrees Celsius and 8% tin, so still at Roman numeral 1, and this red dot right there, what does the microstructure look like? Your answer would go in this bubble right here, and your choices are A, B, C, D, and E. You'll be given 20 seconds to answer this question, but if you need more time, pause the video. It's time for question three. At the point 190 degrees Celsius and 25% tin at Roman numeral two, or this red dot right there, what is the phase composition and weight fraction? Your answer would go in this box up there, and your choices are one, two, three, four, and five. Question four. At the point 190 degrees Celsius and 25% tin, so at Roman numeral two, or this red dot right there, what is the microstructure? Your answer would go in this bubble right there, and your choices are A, B, C, D, and E. Here's question five. At the point 180 degrees Celsius, 25% tin, which would be at Roman numeral three, which would be this red dot right there, what is the phase composition and weight fraction? Your answer would go in this box here, and your choices are one, two, three, four, and five. Question six. At the point 180 degrees Celsius and 25% tin, so at Roman numeral three, or this red dot right there, what is the microstructure? 
your answer would go in this bubble here, and your choices are A, B, C, D, and E. Here's question 7. At the point 210 degrees Celsius and 61.9% tin, which is at Roman numeral 4, or this red dot right here, what is the phase composition and weight fraction? Your answer would go in this box here, and your choices are 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. Here's question 8. At the point 210 degrees Celsius and 61.9% tin, at Roman numeral 4, which is this red dot right here, what is the microstructure? Your answer would go in this bubble here, and your choices are A, B, C, D, and E. On to question 9. At the point 170 degrees Celsius and 61.9% tin, so at Roman numeral 5, or this red dot right there, what is the phase composition and weight fraction? Your answer would go in this box here, and your choices are 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. Here's the last question, number 10. At the point 170 degrees Celsius and 61.9% tin, at Roman numeral 5, or this red dot right there, what is the microstructure? Your answer would go in this bubble right there, and your choices are A, B, C, D, and E. Congratulations, you have just finished the interactive quick quiz on eutectic phase diagrams. You've now learned about the subtleties of phase diagrams. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section. Loved it, hate it, let us know. So thanks for participating.